Come here. Are we going to go inside? Come here, so I can hold your hand. Are we going to go inside? We are. I love to go inside. Um, we'll get flag. You can see everything. The ships that were over there that you got to see, they've already left port. Why? Because they had to go into a new place. Can I get a picture of you with the big gun? Stand by the big gun. Yeah. Like you're shooting it. Yeah, no, don't climb on it. Stand at the back of it. Right here. This is the back. Like you're shooting it. That's a big gun, huh? What are you doing, Caden? No. Wait, wait, I see an Arizona ship. Fire! Okay, <laughs> show me how you shoot. hardened targets such as other ships, uh, reinforced bunkers. Uh, this will penetrate 17 inches of reinforced steel, I'm sorry, of hardened steel, or about seven and a half feet of steel reinforced. Spread it on lines and such. If one of those lines ever broke and you had explosives and ammunition and so on in that load, you want to make sure it fell on a place that wouldn't spark. That was the principal reason for the key. And the very last of the night, this uh, Missouri was always had the big day The tip of the uh, mast down to the keel was 209 feet, 3 inches. Last part, carriers were coming in, those were capable of 30 knots. These protected carriers had to be capable of 4 feet. So it's own bump for the entire floor, so it's not in shape. Just out in front of uh, turret number one here a few minutes ago, and I think you would have noticed that you had to step over or on or around any anti aircraft. But this time she had 110 barrels, right? Caden, stay over here. The um, five inch 
Spanish guns, second decks of wooden sailing ships, and right up into day, today's Navy. Um, the wardroom was always the largest open space in the ship, except for the deck itself. So because of that, battleship. platform in the 40s and 50s uh, featured these big uh, 16 of like a gigantic clamshell and you fire off one, two, three, or four missiles, whatever you need for the occasion. And uh, you can see on this one, if you look at about 2 o'clock, you can see three, three tomahawk insignia. The you know, offensive and defensive no, part of the ship during the 1980s. We may have about 19 to 21 people, something like that, in this room at any time at all times, uh, be under the command of a tactical action officer, TAO. That's a person who has the leadership skills, the technical knowledge, and the... Uh, this particular uh, voyage, our TAO is Grace. She's with the big blue chair, so she's running this room. Uh, nothing's going to happen here without her ordering. Okay, so she's getting her visual information from that vertical quad over there. You've seen it. Subjected to the first atomic bomb ever used in warfare. August 9th, the second, and we all hope the last uh, explosion took place. Do you guys have any questions? Symbol of freedom. No. These ones are double guys. Yeah, they're eagles. Like mom, sugar, This is like heaven. It's like guns. Do we have time? Yeah. Okay. Work here. And 